they'll be calling you a radical back to Indian Point. This is a very, very big deal. And I want people to understand these are fucking liars. They're proven track record sociopathic fucking liars. First off, it took photographs of some freelancers to get photographs of the oil slick in the Hudson, or they would never. And let's think, the propaganda machine, USA lays out our, oh, we're going to clean it up. They're fucking liars. We need Geiger counter fucking readings from the fucking area. That's a big blast. That's a big fucking fire that went on in there. A fucking huge one. Fucking. Now let's think about this. Let's just talk about the whole talking point of nuclear. Oh, nuclear's clean. You don't have to use fossil fuels. And why is there a fucking oil slick in the fucking Hudson River? There's nothing clean. It's the dirtiest filter. You're using fucking electrical power to create electrical fucking power. It's insanity. You're using more fucking dirty fucking power to fucking try to make fucking clean power when it isn't even clean. What's in uranium mine? These lion fuckers, you've seen that black fume go up. You fucking exploded. Oh, transformer fire. Do not believe one fucking word that comes out of these liars. These talking points are set in place. Every one of these reactors, the nuclear cartel that runs up, they have a talking point in place. They have a PR fucking machine in place. The second these things happen, that PR machine goes to fucking work. And they just fucking, they're, they're explaining stuff they don't even know. It's just a lie. Oh, there's nothing. Look, number one, there's a fucking massive explosion in that fucking... These are... Hello? These are nuclear reactors. Now, we will know on what the severity of it is if there is actually a core involved, if there's actually a spam fuel, because they're not going to tell you. These lion fucking rat fuckers in them fucking... What, the media? The pathetic fuckers, the fucking art community, like I said, I cut off my fucking ear and melded it to the fucking new whorehouse. Where's the new whorehouse? At the old MoMA. At the old, the fuck, the old MoMA is the new whorehouse. It's outrageous. There's no fucking artists, there's no spiritual leaders, there's no fucking media. The fucking whole country has no integrity. Fuck it, it's out, it's unbelievable. And everybody just says, oh, whatever. Oh, my friend died of leukemia, whatever. They don't get it. Because they're lazy, they're fucking... I, we're working on this because, I mean, think about it. You got fucking a bunch of freelancers with no money fucking trying to fucking do all this fucking work organizing because we have no fucking media. Because, I mean, people, you have reporters that are making fucking so much money. People the fucking, they just fucking the talking point. These panter painting motherfuckers. Fucking New York City fucking wow. They should be ashamed of them fucking selves. Clean energy. Oil slick in the fucking Hudson. Blowing up, we use fucking energy to fucking make fucking more energy. Fucking, it's outrageous. It's insanely. Let's, okay. At Indian Point, just like the rest of these fucking reactors, sitting there with spent fuel pools. Now think about it. Transformers spilling that much fucking oil. What the fuck is really going on in that fucking unit? There's no fucking transformer that should have that amount of fucking oil. What the fuck are you guys doing in there? Fuck, God only knows. You know, they're set up to hold fucking... They're not built to hold fucking spent fuel pools. They were never set up for that. Remember, that was the deal in the fucking 70s when we battled fighting. Oh, fuck. Well, by law. By law, they were supposed to fucking be put in Yucca Mountain. Political fucking football. By law. Yucca Mountain a bad idea? Fuck yeah, but not as bad as nuclear reactors. We just keep walking this path. More and more of these, like, what's his name? Says it's a mathematical certainty. You know... You'll think when fucking Geiger count ready to start fucking spiking around one of these fucking reactors and there's a mass fucking exodus, and rightfully so. Now, what is it? It's going to take us freelancers. It's going to take people with fucking, you know, because we can get no whistleblower. I got a whistleblower from at any point. I've been right in his face in New York City several times. Right when it gets kind of time to come on camera, he fucking backs down. I understand, because he's got children. These fuckers are so evil, they'll fucking whack you. They'll fucking kill you. Kill me, motherfuckers. Oh, yeah, you already tried to, you know. Oh, they sent you leukemia in the mail, Kevin. Ha, 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 they sent it to all of you. It's called the jet stream. It's called Fukushima. The Pacific Ocean, let's see, major nuclear reactor fucking meltdowns at Fukushima, Japan, four years ago. The ocean's fucking dying over the last four years. Oh, no correlation. That's just, it's just a fucking blob. Fucking the nuclear industry owns the fucking media. They're, I'm going to Vienna, and I'm going to confront the IAEA. These are the, you, you want to talk about the people that run the world? The IAEA, those are the people that run the world. They're the IAEA and the fucking IOC. The corporate board members, they're exact same people. They're not aliens and these superhuman beings. They just been fed. Elizabeth Warren gets it. Fuck Barry Liar fucking Antoinette, you know. I mean, can you believe that guy? 
you know, secret, the TPP secret. And the, the TPP, because slaves in China aren't cheap enough. 37 cents. Do you understand that fucking in Indonesia, slavery is legal? I mean, can you believe that guy? Can you believe what a fucking liar he turned out to be? Fuck, I thought Bill Walmart Clinton was a lying scumbag. Fuck, it's outrageous. So, I'm all over this. Our people are all over this. But do not believe a fucking one word and think about the media machine was out fuck, before anybody even knew anything that was going on. But, all right, so, it's a big fucking event. India Point should fucking shut down tomorrow. All of them shut down tomorrow. This fucking nuclear waste needs to be put in a certain central location and shot into space. Bad idea? Fuck yeah, it's a bad idea. Fucking nuclear's a bad idea. There's no answer for the waste. I'm headed to Vienna for this spent fuel cycle. What's the end of the spent fuel cycle? You know, they want it, they call it win. Don't you love that? Win. Win. Just like here, Western Initiative for Nuclear. They dump it right here in my backyard. And they make these decisions, these fuckers. Well, they just suck money from everybody on this cash cow. We don't use it. 48 reactors off, sending off. We don't use any of this. It's a fucking lie. It's a scam from hell. It's a fucking lie. It's the greatest scam in human history. I mean, it's, is it going to, I mean, ticking time bombs. That's all they are with spent fuel. So let's get real about Indian Point. You know how much spent fuel sitting in that fucker? I mean, they were never built for it. They can't handle the spent fuel. So they have an accident in there. A transformer? What the fuck? Blowing oil into the Hudson? What the fuck? I know a lot about nuclear. I've been a lot of nuclear actors. That much oil? What the fuck is it they're doing in there? Fuck God only fucking knows these lying fuckers. You know, let's hope that one of the fucking spent fuel pools wasn't compromised. Let's hope that one of the core reactors wasn't compromised. But we will know. You know, I'll tell you how we know. Because our army will find out. But, you know, we're just a bunch of stupid fucked up fucking artists. And you panty painter motherfuckers. So, like I said, I blame the spiritual leaders. Fucking media. The, you know, the last bastion is always the fucking artist, you know. But we have the... Like I said, I cut off my ear yesterday and meld it to the fucking... New fucking Queen's whorehouse. The fucking new whorehouse. You guys want to go to the new fucking whorehouse? Walk over to fucking the MoMA. Walk over to the Whitney. Walk over to the fucking Guggenheim. Walk over to the fucking Unnatural History Museum. Walk to the San Francisco MoMA. Go to the Getty fucking in L.A. The new whorehouses. Oh, my cousin's a fucking artist. My niece is an artist in the fucking club. And all you oligarchs. Don't you love all that fucking art they've talked to you in buying fucking there? Hasn't been a piece of art fucking post fucking war hall scans in 40 years worth five fucking cents. You've lost your eyes. Keep fucking listening to these fuckers. Oh, cut. Jenny, my fucking niece here, she's an incredible. Oh, Bork from Ice. Uh, oh, my God, you panty painter motherfuckers are so disgusting. New York City changing its name. New York City's going to change its name. Panty. Uh, you know, just plain panty. New York City, home of the panties, you know? I mean, that's what it is. It's Penny Painter USA. It's not a fucking... Wow, it's fucking pathetic. But the fuck's going on at your point is a big, big fucking deal. And if that... This doesn't wake you dumb motherfuckers up in New York City, you Panner Painter fairy tale fucking fantasy island fucking cultural theme park for fucking people to fucking shop at, your Sesame Street... Fuck, what, oh, excuse me, what an insult, I love Sesame Street. No, what a, that would be an insult to Sesame Street. You're disgusting. What the fuck, you dumb fuckers? You know how much fuel set in there? I'm telling you, if this, I mean, wow. What it is, who fucking knows, because all they do is fucking lie. But we'll find out, but I'm telling you. Sit around until you're fucking evacuating fucking how many millions of people? Wow. I mean, for what? For what? To make a few oligarchs and more fucking money? We don't use the fucking shit. Fucking industry passed it a long time ago. Somebody says, oh, well, free energy's been around for a fucking long time. Yeah, for millions of years. It's called the fucking sun. Solar took the field a long time ago. Technology raced past this. But you're forced to buy it through Price Anderson. You're forced to fucking do it because it's a cash cow from hell for a lot of people. And a lot of people have their fingers in it. And it's fucking, they don't give a fuck. They're fucking sociopaths, sick fuckers. The whole fucking industry. Fukushima should have been the dagger that put the fucking end to all of it. But no. The worst thing to come out of that fucking melted down reactor, Aleph from the Battle of Chernobyl at Chernobyl. The worst thing was not cesium, was not plutonium. It was lies. Kevin Blanche, the worst thing that come out of the Fukushima major fucking meltdown, the ongoing catastrophe that's killing the Pacific Ocean, was not cesium, was not plutonium. It was denial. I mean... Fuck beyond fucking Russian roulette, you stupid fuckers. 
this is a big fucking deal. That's a major fucking blast. Oh, it's clean. You know what, Rebecca? Yeah, yeah, that's why there's an oil slick from a nuclear reactor in the fucking Hudson. You stupid fuckers, what's a uranium mine? You know, it's the dirtiest, filthiest, fucking, unfucking efficient, uneconomical fucking, it meets no fucking matrix fucking what's of any logical thinking human being in the history of mankind. It's a fucking dirty, filthy fucking lie. The greatest fucking lie. Kyle Berkeley, fucking, you rats at Livermore, you rats at MIT, you fucking rats. Oh, you're gonna fucking pay. I can't wait till the fucking masses turn on you fucking nuclear rats. And I hope they hang every fucking one of you. Fuck, we'll find out. We'll dig in. And you dumb fuckers better wake up in that fucking part of the fucking world. You know, you're as bad as the apathetic fuckers in fucking Cal. No, you're worse. Fucking Panty Painter USA. Come to the new fucking whorehouse. The Queen's new whorehouse. Come to the Queen's new whorehouse. In fucking man. And you oligarchs, how do you like that return on investment? That fucking art you've purchased from those fuckers. How do you like that? How do you like that Panty Painter fucking art you paid millions of dollars worth? Go try selling some of it. Ah! You fucking lucky to get 20 cents on the fucking dollar return. Wow, you sad fuckers. Panty Painter USA, New York City. Stand tuned.